What's up, guys? So it has been a long time. I apologize. It's actually been exactly one month since my last update video. Uh, but we are here. We are ready to go. It's actually early in the morning. To, well, not early in the morning. It's 4.30 4 p.m. But for me, that, that counts as early in the morning. Uh, there was two new items added to the group loot chests. That's probably why you're going to see some people spamming all the chests they have saved up. Uh, anyways, let's get into one sec. Okay, so I was having issues formatting uh, on Discord. So I, I just realized that the the update list was not complete. So let's get started. Anyways, with bug fixes, there is uh, just one bug fix. Uh, there sh you should no longer get stuck during the Chambers of Zerik. And this was done by Bank, so all of the credit goes to him. So Shoutouts to Bank for helping us out that. Uh, balancing changes. Uh, the Raider box has been removed. I'll just show you the absence of <laughs> Raider box. I think I just replaced it with the Crystal Key. Uh, and then I'll talk about this item in a second because I'm sure it's going to be a controversial one. Uh, you know what? Never. Okay, good. good. I never double checked the price. Um, so, yeah, Long Shot Bow has had its range strength increased, so it should be a little bit better. Cherry Bandits have been added to Varrock Castle. So, if you're familiar with the event, uh, there was an issue where your drops just stopped appearing. I think part of the problem was uh, a lot of people killing the same thing in the same area because it, it only ever seems to happen at events. So what I decided to do is add some more uh, bandits to the uh, rock here. And then if you go to Lumbridge, you will find some blue raspberry bandits right over here. Blueberries. <laughs> so yeah, hopefully with that being spread out, it shouldn't have any more glitches or issues. Uh, so we'll just talk about the Faux Infernal Cape. So the Faux Infernal Cape is uh, kind of a, a good compromise, I feel. Uh, so how it works is it is not the exact same sets as an Infernal Cape, but it does have the same strength bonus and attack bonuses, which is all that's going to matter. It has half the defensive stats and then half the prayer bonus. Uh, has a nice little, nice little exam in there. Uh, and then um, it cannot be combined with the Infernal Max Cape. So if you see anybody with an Infernal Max Cape, they obviously have earned the Infernal Max Cape. And it will it will work for Completionist, but it will not work for Trimmed Completionist. So uh, that's uh, neither of those things exist at the moment, but uh, if you did want, if you didn't care about Trimmed Completionist and Completionist was good enough for you, then this, uh, this will make it so you don't have to figure out Inferno. But if you want the Trimmed, then you'll have to figure out Inferno. And then of course, anybody with the Max Cape version, you know they've earned it legit. Um, this is, like I said, it is a kind of controversial item, so it, it could be in the donated store for a very short amount of time, uh, or, you know, longer. If you have any feedback, um, give me your feedback. The website I use to make my surveys, uh, I, I don't know if I did too many surveys and now they want to charge me $30 a month to do surveys. That's just not worth it. Fuck that. <laughs> so I need to find a new website or a new way to, to get out, like, polls and stuff like that to get your feedback. But... Of course, you can always just provide feedback in the suggestions discussion section of the Discord general store. Um, you can just you know comment here too. That works if you're listening to this. But anyways, let's get back to the update. So until the end of the event, the uh, flavor bandits are dropping uh, five dollar bonds. Yeah, yeah, yeah. With a, I mean a pretty solid chance. So go kill those bandits real fast. Uh, you can now get, uh, smash lightsabers with the Zenite Hammer. Let me see if I have it in my bank. So you can now smash hammers and you'll get inactive crystals. You can use these inactive crystals to combine them with a mysterious hilt to create Luke's lightsaber and or Vader's lightsaber. It is a new and improved lightsaber, better stats, uh, better speed, uh, better damage against group bosses yeah very nice uh no, no you know what? i'm just gonna make some i'm gonna somebody has to get it before you can see what they look like although you can sort of you know put your uh, imagination to work there there is also one more group loot item as i mentioned dark lights core so this is kind of a complex one let me spawn all the items to show you what you need to make it okay so this is the other item that you can get from group loot chest now it is called dark lights core and you need these seven pairs of boots to make dark light boots so yeah these are new best in slot boots uh not going to show you what they look like but get these eight items total <laughs> and make them yourself so at the event the thieving stall can now give you tokens 
It is also uh, respawns faster. I don't know if you noticed. It used to respawn pretty slow. Now it uh, is faster. And there we go right there. It's token. So I mean, it gives a chance, uh, you know, to, to to catch up. At this point, it really the cherries are just taken away with it. But you know, learned a lot from the event. It was really just an experiment. I didn't want to force people to just pick whatever team had the lowest amount of players. That seemed like it. I don't know. I just felt like it defeated the purpose of of having like the flavors. And then we should have just picked red and blue and. I don't know, that probably would have been, it was, it was dumb, it, it, whatever, it was dumb, <laughs> whatever. Uh, so, yeah, uh, uh, tokens, tokens, and faster. And I think more cash, I don't know if that was, I really didn't get a lot of cash, that was me. And then we have the last update, next is 100% live, you can get drops, Torva, Ancient God Sword, everything is in game. Uh, also added a little bank chest like we talked about, make sure you update your client if you don't see the bank. Are they are they in one? I don't think there's enough people to, to start one at the moment, but uh, it's not crazy difficult, and it is a group boss. Everyone gets loot, so we'll see how it goes. Uh, the new lightsaber should be good there. Um, oh, and then the last thing in the update is the okay. Oh, oh by the way, the the barrel chest pet is not going to be good here. Did it kill? Oh, nice. Oh, nice. Nice. Pet don't work here. The drops work differently. Dark just dark just coated it a different way. Path kind of messed up. That's I don't think it moves at all for me. I think it, uh, it's, uh, it's it's definitely not 100%, but it's 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 playable enough. It, it damages you pretty decent. It makes you work for the loot, and and uh, I think it's fair. So obviously we want to you know keep getting some work on it, but we've been working on it for a long time. So I thought like it was it was time to add rewards at least. So that's the main thing everybody's going to want. Uh, and then the last thing uh, is you can disassemble Dragon Heart Necklace, Longshot Bow, and Blessings. Yeah. Uh, so, anyways, that is going to do it for the video. Thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, apologize for the massive delays on content. I know this is the first update in a month, and that's you know that's not acceptable. So, need to pick the pace. My plan is God Wars Two. That was the plan like five months ago, but it really it's really the plan now.